It's important to note that while this video was posted today, police say the incident actually happened in December of 2018. Now, though, we're beginning to see the fallout. I asked you for a sheriff. Bellevue police say they pulled the woman over at the Factoria Mall for failing to transfer the title of her car. They say she was uncooperative with the officer, kept the car in gear, and kept reaching into her purse. Put you out on your stomach. At which point, Officer Will Dowsing takes her down and puts her in what police call a neck restraint. How do you justify the taking down like that and, and putting the arm around the neck? So I get it. I understand. When, when I first saw the video, uh, I raised my eyebrows and I said, hang on a second. Chief Steve Millette says Dowsing acted appropriately because the woman refused to comply with his calm and repeated requests, and he believes she might have a weapon or try to escape. A photo released by the department appears to show the officer's knee on her neck, but Millette says that wasn't the case. And I know there are going to be people that are going to sit there, Chief, look at that video. It, it, the, clearly, the knee is on the neck. According to the officer, and again, based on um, the training that I've witnessed, the knee is up here in the upper back. You're kidnapping me. Additional video released by the department shows the woman screaming that she was being kidnapped by police. <laughs> Millette now says he has suspended the use of neck restraints unless the officer finds himself in a situation that calls for deadly force. Training video provided by the department shows a technique used six to ten times a year by Bellevue police with no serious injuries or deaths. Even so, the chief says it's time to take a pause. Does getting rid of that technique put them at greater risk? So the officers don't like this technique technique being taken away. Eric. It's a divisive topic. I know it is. By the way, Bellevue police tell us that woman was not hurt in the incident. They say she didn't even file a complaint with the department. At the Bellevue Police Headquarters, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.